Semantic memory is a type of memory that involves the storage and recall of general knowledge about the world. It includes facts, concepts, and meanings that are not tied to personal experiences or specific events. Unlike episodic memory, which is about personal experiences, semantic memory is more about knowing what rather than when or where. Semantic memory encompasses a wide range of knowledge. For example, knowing that the capital of Japan is Tokyo, understanding that a dog is a type of animal, or recognizing that water freezes at zero degrees Celsius are all examples of semantic memory. This type of memory helps us make sense of the world around us by organizing information into a structured format that can be easily accessed and used when needed. One of the main features of semantic memory is that it is abstract and generalized. This means that it doesn't require us to remember the context in which we learned the information. For example, you may not remember where or when you learned that the Eiffel Tower is in Paris, but you still know this fact. Semantic memory is crucial for everyday functioning, as it allows us to use language, understand concepts, and solve problems. There are several benefits to having a well-developed semantic memory. First, it aids in communication. Our ability to understand and use language relies heavily on semantic memory. For instance, knowing the meanings of words and how to use them in sentences helps us convey ideas and understand others. Second, semantic memory supports learning. When we acquire new information, it often builds on what we already know. A strong foundation of general knowledge makes it easier to learn and integrate new concepts. Finally, semantic memory enhances problem-solving skills. By drawing on our knowledge of facts and concepts, we can analyze situations, make informed decisions, and find solutions to complex problems. However, semantic memory also has its limitations. One significant limitation is that it can be affected by neurological conditions such as Alzheimer's disease, which primarily impacts declarative memory, including semantic memory. Individuals with such conditions may struggle to recall basic facts and concepts that were once familiar. Additionally, Semantic memory can sometimes lead to errors or misconceptions. For example, if you have learned incorrect information, it becomes part of your semantic memory and can influence your understanding and decisions until corrected. Semantic memory is one of two types of declarative memory. The other type is called episodic memory. To learn about episodic memory, watch this video next.